Hello learners, welcome to grade 4 science class. Today, we will explore more about weather components and its corresponding weather instrument. In our previous lesson, you have learned about the importance of water cycle. Water cycle is a continuous movement of water on Earth's surface with the help of sun's heat. The sun makes water from the oceans and land evaporates and changes to vapor through the process of evaporation. Plants also absorb water from the runoff and evaporate the water into the atmosphere through the process of transpiration. Water vapor in the atmosphere changes to tiny droplets of water that form clouds through the process of condensation. Water droplets in the clouds change to rain, snow, sleet, and hail that falls to the earth through the process of precipitation. For our quick review, identify the process of water cycle based on the given diagram. 1. The process when water from lakes, seas, ocean turn into gas. Number, number 2. The process when water from the plants evaporates. 3. The changing of water from gaseous state back to a liquid state in the form of clouds. 4. The falling of any form of water from the atmosphere back to the surface of the earth. And number 5. The accumulation of precipitation into rivers, lakes, and ocean. Now, compare your answer. Do you get all the numbers right? Marvelous! We can now go on to our new topic, different components of weather and the common weather instruments. For our most essential learning competency, use weather instruments and describe the different weather components in a weather chart. At the end of this video lesson, you were expected to Describe the different components of weather. Identify and describe common weather instruments. Describe and identify the trends on how the different components of weather are reported in a weather chart. And last, infer weather condition in a given sample weather chart. When we say weather, it is the state of the atmosphere at a particular place during a short period of time. It changes from hour to hour or day to day in different places. Weather help you decide what games to play. During fine weather, people enjoy doing outdoor activities such as camping, flying a kite, and field trips. Those activities are seldom held during rainy days. Weather also help you decide what clothes to wear. We feel comfortable wearing light colored thin clothes on warm weather and dark colored thick clothes during cold weather. There are six main components or elements of weather. These are temperature, atmospheric pressure, wind, humidity, precipitation, cloud cover or sky condition. Every day, through the weather forecast, the Pagasa provides us weather information. Class, do you know the instrument the meteorologists use in order to predict the weather? One of the instruments they use is thermometer. Thermometer measure the air temperature or the hotness or coldness of the air. Sinusukat nito kung gaano kainit o gaano kalamig ang hangin sa paligid. Most thermometers are closed glass tubes containing liquids such as alcohol and mercury. When air around the tube hits the liquid, the liquid expands and moves off the tube. The scales such as 10, 20, 30, 40 degrees Celsius shows what actual temperature is. 
Another weather instrument is barometer. Barometer measure air pressure. Sinusukat nito ang bigat ng dami ng molekula sa hangin na bumubuo sa atmosfera. It tells us whether the pressure is rising or falling. A, a rising barometer means sunny and dry condition, while falling barometer means stormy and wet condition. We also have a anemometer. Anemometer measure wind speed. Sinusukat nito ang bilis o bagal ng ihip ng hangin. Wind speed may be breeze or moderate. Occasionally, it blows mildly, but in some other time, it blows fast. The cup scatters the wind, turning the dial attached to the instrument. The dial shows wind speed. Another weather instrument is wind vane. It is an instrument that determines the direction from which the wind is blowing. Kung mapapansin mo, ang wind vane ay may apat na pangunahing direction. North, east, south, and west. Kung saan nakaturo ang arrowhead ng wind vane, doon ang gagaling ang hangin. Halimbawang ito ay nakaturo sa east. Ang hangin ay tinatawag na east wind. We also have wind suck. The wind suck shows both the speed and direction of the wind. The wind suck rotates at the pole and display wind direction. A strong wind shown by the wind suck blowing straight out. The suck is loose when there is light breeze. We also have hygrometer. Hygrometer measures the water vapor content of the air or the humidity. High humidity indicates warmer temperature, while low humidity indicates cooler temperature. Mas mataas ang water vapor or humidity sa hangin, mas maalinsangan ang panahon. Mas mababa ang humidity sa hangin, mas malamig ang temperatura. The last one is rain gauge. Rain gauge measures the amount of rain that has fallen over a specific period of time. Rain gauge indicates the amount of precipitation that is released by the atmosphere. Weather instruments allow meteorologists to analyze and evaluate the data of weather components collected. Here is the example of weather chart. It tells about weather components that determine the weather condition at any given time. Daily weather report help you know the weather condition. Weather report is important. We should give accurate data on air temperature, wind speed and direction, the amount of humidity in the air, and of course the sky condition. With the help of weather chart, we can decide of activities for that day. It also helps us to be safe and to prepare for a possible danger and calamities. Okay, for activity number one, wondering about weather. Describe the different components, elements of weather. Identify weather elements shown in each picture. Choose the answer from the
for activity 2 measuring the weather objective identify and describe common weather instrument part a name the following weather instruments choose the answer from the box Activity 3. Tracking the weather. Objective. Describe and identify the trends on how the different components of weather are reported in a weather chart. Analyze the given weather report. Today, at 7 o'clock a.m., Kaloocan City will experience partly cloudy morning with isolated rain shower or thunderstorm, with temperatures around 23 degrees Celsius rising to 25 degrees Celsius by mid-morning. A strong easterly wind is expected with up to 30 km per hour gas winds. Based on the weather report, record the weather elements using the table below. the weather objective infer weather condition in the given weather chart study the weather chart infer the weather condition based on the given data below okay now let's answer the guide question what are the weather elements presented in the chart? How will you describe the weather condition in Manila, Cebu, and Davao? How does the weather chart help you in predicting the weather condition? Okay, for Activity 5, today's weather report. Objective, infer weather condition in the given weather chart. Make a simple weather report based on the given weather chart. Write your answer on your ISM. Okay, now let's check your understanding. Find and encircle the words that are related to weather in the crossword puzzle. Words are formed vertically, horizontally, and diagonally. Some words are formed backward. Scramble the letter to form a word. Draw lines connecting the words to the pictures and to the function as well.
Steve, after doing all the activities, I know you are now ready to answer the post test. Enjoy learning!